closer out there, and there's like three people in this shanty town that should probably house like a hundred thousand. It's fine. And then they all the hundred thousand you were looking for showed up on the bridge. <gasps> what is this? Scan. Mission gear. Oh, it's like the ice picks. Saw you. That is a dead Let end. Let me cut. Jump. Cut. Okay. We could explore for half a second so we could scan that gear. Good. Lovely. I can uh, probably more cutscenes. Oh, we get to press the button. Yeah, we're, we're special. We get to press the button in the truck. We get to press the button in here. We're super cool. Why are they, like, facing the exact... They look weird. At least Ryan's just chilling. They're, like... Yeah, they're not normal. Great as a board looking that way. I trust Ryan. I don't trust these boys. These boys, they're traitors. I don't like her. She's prejudiced against us for no reason. And she's oh, yeah. overprotective and robbed us of us being with our dad. Look at all that water. I bet the ice caps did melt. Like, look at that. Like, like it just, just ends at one point. It just turns into blue. I want to, like, look over there. Let me move. Excuse me. I'll be there in a second. Make sure the ship waits for me. Yeah, see, there's, like, a, a sea wall. Is that a, no, it's just a regular wall. Yep, that doesn't look doesn't look great. I bet we're right that the ice caps melted and flooded everything, but also turned the entire rest of the planet into a desert because of how hot and gross it is. Emergency supplies. Okay, we probably shouldn't have the spaceship wait for us. I'm coming. I was just looking at the view. Oh yeah, it looks even smaller up close. I mean, the inside of spaceships usually are. I mean, this is pretty spacious for a spaceship. But I guess this one that has to... Is this the one that they're going to fly in to Mars? This looks like the size spaceship you would use to, like, be in orbit around the planet. Hello. Where are they? Oh, they're up there. Launch sequence initiated. Opera team, this is ground control. Press the buttons. Final check. Copy, GC. Opera team, comms check. Go. Hmm. Go. Go. Uh. Go. Go. Cat. Systems check. <gasps> Oxygen. Hail and Alex. Oxygen. Oh, that's us. Oxygen is go. Got it. Flight. Flight. Flight is go. Navigation. Navigation. Navigation is go. Ground launch sequencer. Why are we doing everything? Ground launch sequencer. Because we're smart. Is go. That's true. Why is she going out of order? Fuel is go. Liquid oxygen. That's one. Liquid oxygen is go. Power. Gotcha. Power is go. Launch sequence functions. Gotcha. Launch sequence functions are go. Propellant load check. What? Good to go. Oh, oh there's <laughs> there I don't need more switches. Air, air composition check. They make this look way too easy. Like the inside of spaceships look like a nightmare. Position are go. Sarah, start fuel cell thermal conditioning. It's not me. Conditioning is a go. Cat. Strong back retract. Huh? Here we go. This one. Nice. I feel like, does the spaceship usually do all this? I feel like mission control probably does a bunch of this. Strong back successfully retracted. I mean, it seems like we don't really have a mission control. I guess that's true. That would make sense. Where's Maria? Maria? Who's that? That was Why the lady that was on the call. Oh, Maria, Gaza Maria Gonzalez. Yeah, she like. Um, well, she was one of the. the she was one of the Cat pictures. So I'm guessing she's just like a higher up. Retract things. I was not paying attention. Uh, uh, where's Where's orange? Huh, here we go. But like, is she like? I don't know. What am I doing? I don't didn't hear what she said. Orbiter access arm is retracted. Nice. I did it. Copy. Start auxiliary power. Jeez, we have so many checklists to go through. I mean, I guess that makes sense for a spaceship. But yeah, I think she's probably just a higher up in whatever the, um... Oh. Puzzles. I don't know. Excuse me. I want to interact with other stuff. There we go. Oh, I just have to look at it. What? This one. No. This one. No. No. 
I was focusing on where they had to go, not what they were. There we go. Sorry, sorry. I did it. Auxiliary power units are go. Copy. Attract gaseous oxygen sensor. Uh, this one. Rotate this way. Sure, zero, that's fine. Slide down. I, I'm glad they took me on this mission because I definitely know what I'm doing. What am I doing? Retracting it. And oh, there we go. So you. Beanie cap retracted. Beanie cap. Go. 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 Press the button. Whoa. Yeah. Transfer complete. We're on internal power. Sarah, activate launch pad down to pressure. Hmm. Suppression system online. There's a lot of things to do. Yeah. I think it takes like a couple hours to get the like when they launch the actual spaceship. So fuel thrusters, that one. Yeah. Here we go. Solid fuel thrusters are a go. We're going. We're going. You still got oh, checklist things. Go. I'm just kidding. Power. Whoa. Here we go. I don't think I'd be able to move my head around this easily. A bunch of G forces, right? Yeah. And when you get to like top speed in one of these things, I bet the G forces are ridiculous. This one's red though. It's not the little green. Got him. <laughs> Got him, coach. Jeez. Yeah, I said, um, like, listen to astronauts talk about the it taking off. They're like, it feels like you're strapped to the front of a rocket ship. Or, like, a rocket. He's like, which you literally are. And he's like, he, like, he said that, like, the shaking like this. He's like, it's super real. It feels like you're, like, about to just, like, explode. <laughs> which, I mean, makes sense, because you literally are just on, like, Behind the where the crew is is like literally just one massive bomb that's continuously going off in the form of rocket. 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 Have you seen my rocket? It's amazing. Oh, look, we're almost out of space. Amazing. Keeps getting darker, then it will just all of a sudden go black. Go black. Max Q. Do you know why the sky is blue? It's because of a. Uh, what is the word? It's, I'm passing uh, out. Ooh. It's because of the gas, right? Cat, initiate stage one separation. Yeah, so the gas in the atmosphere ref like refracts a bunch of uh, um, blue light. Mm-hmm. So that light gets like scattered Go. throughout the atmosphere, so that's why it looks blue. Isn't that fun? Oh, we see. more Go. rockets! It seems like we're doing majority of the important stuff. Yeah, no. It's a good thing they have us on this mission. They would have uh, been screwed, apparently. Go. Anything else? It should be black now if we're in space. No more blue. Also, I feel like once you get into space, you don't really see that... You don't really see very many stars. I'm sure I thought that guy was outside, but he's just chilling inside. <laughs> you thought there was just a thing. What's wrong with you? There's a space... Why is there a space toy? I guess to give us the... There would be like, by the way, weightless. You're floating now. Wow, Earth looks like crap. You know, it does not look good. But it looks like there's a lot more land than we thought. Um, I mean... That could be like Russia and like fits underwater. Oh, that's true, I didn't think about that. Look at all these buttons. <laughs> this is some uh a design artist who was like, let's just put a crap ton of buttons that have no use. The have, funny thing is is that a lot of these up. panels look like more what I would expect on the inside of a spaceship, whereas this looks very modern and you know, nice looking. Whereas those things that look like an absolute mess. Um is what I would expect from uh an actual spaceship. And it's away. Because all those buttons have like the little cages around it, so, or like mm -hmm. behind the switches, so you can't flip them accidentally and stuff. And they have like all the light up push buttons. 
Whereas these are like very nice dials and switches. Come on, let's go to let's go to Mars. Are we gonna hit hyperspeed? We have one more thruster to engage. We haven't done any of this stuff. No, we did the dials. Not the these dials, ones? the sliders. No, we did these ones over here. Oh. So we still have one more engine to press and then mess with this stuff. Cruise mode. Here we go. Launch me. But the sun's over there. We're not launching that way. We launched the other way. And... End scene. Great job. Want to go to space? Opera team travels to Mars. Here we go, Opera team. A journey of a thousand miles. Safely launched Zephyr 3. Hmm. Babe, did you prepare philosophical quotes for the entire journey, or...? Only like five a day. I don't like that it said safely launch. Thinking that we could do it not safely. That would've been funny. Maybe I just need books. You didn't like it? Hmm. I mean, it's great. Truly. Who was that? Was that Claire? One small step was already taken, so... <laughs> oh, wow, old school, huh? Yeah. We're floating. You never look excited. Don't be cheeky. I was as frugal as possible. She designed the ship. But, however, I did splurge on one last minute addition. What is it? A window. You're really ruining the moment, so. <laughs> Just look. Look at our crap Earth. <laughs> not that beautiful Earth. Yeah, no, it does not look great. I've seen pictures of the Earth from space, and they look amazing. That looks pretty crap. I mean, I guess it still look awesome looking at it, but... It looks so flat, the spaceship. Look at all these satellites. You would not be able to see those satellites. Because if they're in orbit, they're traveling at like 11,000... They're traveling like 2 miles a second or something, or like 5 miles a second. They would just be not even like be able to see them going by. Pretty cool, though. Get your ass to Mars. He's messing with my head. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Oh, sister moment. I thought they were going to hold hands. So did I. Sarah and Ryan are probably settling into their pod. Oh, sleep pods, yeah. Out of the cockpit. Be right there. Or are we just staying up? Can't be. It takes like six months. I guess it depends on what speed they're traveling. Who knows? Yeah, so I'm curious how fast we're actually going to get to Mars. Probably a long time. I hear water. <gasps> okay, we're, no. we're snorkeling. <gasps> We're back in time. Well, then this hopefully will be a nicer planet. Who's, who's that? Is that our dad? Sounds like it. Is this in the lake that we're outside our house? Jeez. Can't be. Sound like he said. Bubble gum. It doesn't look like bubble gum at all. A toe. A toe. She British? Of course. <laughs> if this is the lake outside our house, this is ridiculous. Mum loved diving too. Mum. We used to go diving together all the time after daddy's training. So she's dead. So she was dead even back then. So was that Sarah? Why is it so dirty Was Sarah and him like dating? This is very confusing. So I'm guessing her mom died a long time ago. He was dating Sarah. But also Sarah doesn't seem old enough to have dated her dad. Or maybe they were just working together. Ooh. Ooh. 
Jeez. Nope. Those aren't good news. You heard that too, right? Yes. I'm in the cockpit checking the diagnostics. Meet me here? Sure. Control center. Where are there random screens? Wasn't the cockpit like right next to us? I think you're going the right way. Yeah, because this is where we were. Okay. I thought the cockpit was like just right on the other side of it. Oh gosh, I have to roll. Yeah, we're in space. I have to like do all all the degrees of movement. I don't like that. Where am I going? Ouch, sorry. Oh, the door opened, the door opened. It sounded like the door opened. Oh, wow. Hello. Hello. There we go. The ACA didn't the we need eyes on to determine the damage. I'll perform an EVA and let you know, GC. Copy. Mm, EVA. Interesting. Probably. Could you keep an eye on the diagnostics? I'll get ready. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Let me do it. Look, I need real <laughs> life experience out there. Whoa. All the EVAs we could have, this one is pretty safe, right? Whoa. I mean, I Stop. could just casually just mention spinning. my stellar extravehicular activities training. That's a cool trick. No, it's fine. I think it was 94. Time <laughs> is 95. See, you're so much better with numbers. Best you monitor <laughs> the diagnostics. Fine. Just be very careful. We're still in orbit, so watch out for debris. Watch Got out it. for debris. <laughs> and I'll guide you on comms. Yeah, I'll just I'll look out for those pieces of metal flying at two miles a second, you know. Oh, we're going outside. Yeah, EVA, man. I've double checked it, Claire. I'm fine. Let me push the button. Claire, I've got this. I've got this. Whoa. All right. Egress out of the airlock. I don't even have like a EVA suit on. I guess that's what, <laughs> man, that, that visor went down way too close to that door opening <laughs> that I'd be comfortable with. We're EVAing in just like the suit, this suit. Okay. Hmm. Cut here for emergency rescue. <laughs> so what's all this from anyway? Satellite. Looks like a Minecraft ship. This is a horrible idea. We're not even, uh... Connected to the ship. Um, We're fine. Kind of honored. I guess that's what advanced what technology gets us. Oh, we have to go with the thruster. Right, first thing first. <laughs> what can you see? Is there any damage to the thruster? I'm going there. I'm getting there, boy. I know we're controlling her, but she seems way too comfortable out here. Well, <laughs> um, just the fact that we're not even connected to the ship. I mean. I guess you can cut corners with uh, modern technology and stuff. Um, no. It's just like the the nozzle. They are damaged. They're pretty badly bent. They're screwed. Yes, cutting. I'm so good at that. Yeah, it is. Cool. And watch out for the fuel canisters. If you hit one of those while you're Whoa. Well, don't. <gasps> fuel canisters. Can we cut those? Can you just worry. choose to cut them anyway? Very Can we cut them, please? Very careful. Very careful. Turn the power Whoa, off. please. The I want to turn the power off. Flip of the swish. Nice. Cut. Oh, jeez. Seems like we got a more powerful one now that we're in space. The bay? Looks like a lake to me. I was just thinking about it earlier. Did Dad ever take you swimming there when you were young? He did, but not when I was that young. I'm trying to cut it. There we go. Is she mad because her dad liked us better? <laughs> well, he, he let us go when we were a small child. Mm -hmm. Come on. 
Nope, you they're married. It's a very serious conversation to have. I'm cutting off a piece of the ship. <laughs> no, how rude. She's saying my love doesn't count. This is a pretty odd conversation. Yeah, that was kind of a weird. Hey, do you have feelings for anyone on the ship, even though the other two people are married and we're siblings? You can still have feelings for someone, even if they're married. Jeez. A weird... A weird piece of dialogue. At the bottom. Cut! Die! Should I hit one of those fuel cells? Mm, yep. Cut! Just on the outside? Ah! Ooh, ooh. Just kidding. I wonder if the game would just, like, end. They put, the, they put those in a very... I have to, like, go from this side, so I don't care. There we go. Got him. It's done. Okay, good job. Turn the power back on and I'll run a diagnostic. On it. Please she don't. She fires the thrusters. Don't say don't thrust her away from me. Be a disaster. Flip it this. I'll flip that one. What the heck is that? What's happening? <laughs> Let's flip. These ones. You what didn't do it. it. Flip, flip, flip. Did you flip the red ones? Oh. Huh? What's going on? <laughs> sure. I guess that works. I have to get them all lit. Or not. Okay. Oh, no. Don't this do this is a trial me. and error thing. What a dumb puzzle. <laughs> it's like a kill switch coordination or something. Or like sequence. Well, that was interesting. Power's back on. Running diagnostic now. Mm. We're good. Okay. Great job, yeah. Head back inside. And carefully. See ya. Okay, that's a, that's a, that's a little far. <laughs> Oh, we're only on two bars of oxygen left. Oh crap, is that- <laughs> I didn't, wasn't even paying attention to that, to be honest. Those little blue lights at the bottom, I'm pretty sure, are oxygen. Or it is it us... our thruster power? Because uh, it showed us, at the beginning in the bottom right, it showed us four bars of oxygen. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad you noticed that, because I would have just kept flying around like an idiot. <laughs> what a low-key oxygen um, indicator. Hope you don't miss it. Oh, we're back in water. Cool. Why does the water look all weird? Hmm. Whoa. What the heck? Whoa. Why was there like speed boosts? Hmm. Hmm. Uh. No school. No, I mean, These masks are cool. That's cool. You can hear him through his mask. Like through the water. When you're close to him, that's cool. So yeah. I have a bad habit of focusing on other stuff and not paying attention to what they're saying. You're saying something about the doors. Let's continue. Explore the wreck. Oh, we're gonna get a speed boost, ready? And... Roosh. How fun. It. How fun. I wish I could get a water speed boost. That sounds cool. A cockpit! Anything? I mean, they made a big deal about... Find the cockpit, and now there's not going to be anything in here! It's a cockpit! Yeah, well, useless. Anything else? There's something over there. 
feels very clear for being a dirty there's an invisible wall cool so maybe we're supposed to go in here and actually find something why isn't dad come with us no, come on very, deep it's very open it's not like it's giving us a very direct way to go oh wow pretend you're an astronaut i was just in here Maybe you can like pull a lever or sit in a seat or something. There's nothing to interact with. Oh, there we go. Here we go. Flip the switch. Press the butt. Oh, gosh. Stop freaking out. Yep, yep. Boop, bop. Big lever. Ooh. Are we going to fall off the edge? Here we go. There it is. Knew it. How is it still operational? Zumba, where, where are you? Dad, please help me. Kathy, hold on. I'm scared. I'm in the cockpit. I'm gonna get you out of there. Dad. So you. Kathy. Stupid child. Kathy. Kathy. That would be terrifying, to be fair. True. And now we're in wooden. I was gonna say those headphones look weird. Headphones. Hey, Ayla. How are you? 